The city of Rome is on many Mediterranean cruise itineraries. Cruise ships dock at Civita Vecchia, a small port city about 50 miles northwest of Rome. So how does one travel between Civita Vecchia and the eternal city of Rome? Well, we're here to help. But first, please consider to like, subscribe, comment, and share. There are a number of ways to travel between Civita Vecchia and Rome. If you are going on your own, the easiest and most cost effective ways are train and bus. Let's look at the train. There is very good train service between Civita Vecchia and Rome, including cheap regional trains and slightly faster express trains. Regional trains run twice hourly on commuter style trains starting around 5 a.m. and ending around 10 p.m., taking around 70 to 90 minutes to travel the full route. This train stops at three stations in Rome before ending at Termini Station. If you're heading to Civita Vecchia, just reverse directions. These trains cost less than 5 euro each way. The regional trains run with double-decker carriages Seats are not reserved. There is a small space between the seat where you can put a medium-sized suitcase and there is overhead storage for smaller bags. Trains are not normally crowded except at the height of rush hour, into Rome in the morning and out in the evening. You must validate your regional train ticket before boarding the train. Faster intercity trains sometimes run on this route as well, taking about an hour. Tickets for those start around 13 euro each way, but can cost much more depending on demand and class of service. Rome's Termini Station is the final stop. It is the main train station for the city of Rome, where you will find a host of tourist services from a travel agency, car rental desk, a medical center, and baggage storage. You can also access Rome's Metro, lines A and B. If you need to go to the airport, the Leonardo Express, to Fiumicino Airport runs from tracks 23 and 24. Pro tip. If you are traveling from the Porta Civita Vecchia to Rome for the day, we suggest you buy a BIRG regional ticket. This ticket will allow unlimited travel on all forms of transportation. That's right unlimited travel on all forms of transportation, including trains, buses, metros, and trams within the Lazio region of Italy, up until midnight of the day you activate the ticket. The Lazio region is divided into seven zones. To include Civita Vecchia in Rome, you will need a ticket that includes five zones. The BIRG regional ticket is especially useful for a day trip from the port to Rome and back. Note, this ticket is not good for going to the airport. From April to November 1st, there's an express train called Civita Vecchia Express, just for cruise ship passengers. This train is scheduled to coordinate with the arrival and departure times of the cruise ships. The train connects Civita Vecchia with Roma San Pietro and Roma Ostiense stations but not Roma Termini. Civita Vecchia Express departs Civita Vecchia at 9.07 a.m. and arrives at Roma Ostiense Station at 10.10 a.m. with one stop at Roma San Pietro Station near the Vatican. In the afternoon, the train departs Roma Ostiense Station at 4.30 p.m. and arrives at Civita Vecchia at 5.20 Tickets cost 10 euro one way, or 15 euro round trip. If you're with a family, kids up to 12, travel free with an adult. So where can you get tickets for the train? At the ticket counter of any train station, self-service ticket kiosk, or online with Train Italia or their mobile app. The BIRG regional pass can be purchased at a ticket counter. And now for the bus. SIT Bus runs a daily bus service between Civita Vecchia and Rome. The bus leaves from Largo della Pace 
at 9.30 a.m. with stops in Rome near the Vatican and at Termini Station. In the afternoon, the return bus departs from Termini Station at 3.30 p.m. Tickets cost 15 euro one way or 25 euro round trip. You can buy tickets online or from the driver on board. With bags in hand, you have made it to Civita Vecchia. Train station. The port is only a half mile away. Option one, public bus. Affordable and convenient, catch the local bus from the train station just outside the station. It makes a few stops before reaching Largo de la Pache, but still takes less than 10 minutes to reach the port. At Largo de la Pache, cruise ship passengers can take a free shuttle to their cruise ship terminal. The ticket costs three euro and can be bought at a newsstand or at the bar inside the train station. Runs approximately every 20 minutes from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. The Chavita Vecchia Port Link bus travels between the train station and Largo de la Pache directly. Costs six euros, but you can pay on board. Largo de la Pache is the main information point of, of the port of Civita Vecchia. It is the point of arrival and departure for all cruise passengers. From here, it is possible to reach all cruise ship docks through a free shuttle. All shuttles leaving from the cruise terminals take you to Largo de la Pache. In 10 to 15 minutes, you will arrive at your destination. Option 2. Port Mobility operates a shuttle that travels between the train station and the cruise ship terminals without stopping at Largo de la Pache. This shuttle service is for cruise passengers only. The shuttle costs 6 euros, but is included in the price if you buy a Chavita Vecchia Express train ticket. Option 3. Walking. Enjoy the scenic route. Walk from the train station to the port, taking the beautiful views and the heat. The pedestrian entrance of Varco Forteza is just 600 meters away. Once inside the port complex, you can take one of the free shuttles to Largo de la Pache. From there, change to the shuttle heading to your cruise terminal. Taxis. Not all taxis have permission to enter the port area. They can only go as far as the port gate. If you're taking a taxi to the port, ensure they have authorization to the pier, Molo, to bring you all the way to your ship. Otherwise, you'll have to ride the shuttle bus. Please subscribe, and if you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up.